conference, we've seen uh, four different examples of thinking about integrating theory, research, and, and practice. And um, there will be one more of, of this uh, theoretical uh, approach that we'll do at the end of the, the next uh, plenary. We'll talk a little bit about integrating theory, research, and practice from a CIP um, perspective. The way the conference is designed, we have people who are summarizing each of the, the kind of key elements of this, uh, each of the plenaries. So Saba will be integrating um, and talking a little bit about the key points from this plenary, uh, and that will be included in the publication that we'll have um, after this. Um, so that will happen for each of the plenary sessions that we have. Uh, I would encourage you to talk to the four presenters uh, who have spoken this morning. Uh, you have lots of opportunity. This is a small conference, uh, and the beauty of a small conference is there's ample opportunities to talk and interact. So to come back and really say, what did you mean by, or how would I apply this, or how would this, th this idea relate to this idea, I uh, encourage you to, to really do that. And uh, as, we, as we leave for our break, uh, which we'll have for about uh, 15 minutes, um, I encourage you to think about one example of integrating theory, research, and practice. It is that moment when the door closes. When you go with your client and you sit down in the room, the door closes, and what the practitioner or counselor says at that moment is the integration of theory, research, and practice. The client themselves are trying to figure out what's happening here, what is counseling, how does it work. They're beginning to form their own theory and integrating their idea about theory and practice, what the counselor is attempting to do. So that integration, that connectedness occurs at the moment we sit down with someone and talk with them, whether it's a brief intervention or a longer term intervention. And that's what we're about. It's making a, a difference, improving the quality of that interaction between the practitioner and the people we serve. Um, so we have a break. Yeah.